Welcome to the start of my revisit for Atelier Iris. Yeah, I decided to go back and replay the first one, Eternal Mana. After all, I figured I'd work on some games I enjoy and, you know, work on some others that I really hate at some point this month. Though, Atelier Among the Hate List is a Lunar Dragon song. A game so bad some people can't even watch you play it, that's how bad it is. Ugh. May work on that one tomorrow, I'm not sure. Ugh. I am not looking forward to it. I have to admit, you know, playing this one's gonna make me sweat, because if I want to work on PS2 stuff, I gotta leave my air conditioner off, um, so I can hear the game. Otherwise, you know, between the headset and the AC, I can't hear the TV anymore, which is a bit of a problem. Ugh, because it's a window AC unit, so it's pretty loud. So yeah, we're gonna start a new game. After all, there's nothing to really do in a continue in this game. There's no new game plus, like Monokaima. At least not as far as I'm aware. Well, now. <laughs> oh, yeah, this thing has to start off with a flashback. There you are. It's always so weird when games start off like that. Sort of like Final Fantasy hey, X did that, too. It's you weird. Be resting? Yes. Clayne, do you remember the day we met? <laughs> Of course I do. It wasn't that long ago. I've been thinking about that. Like in universe is like what a week or two. <laughs> I know I keep interrupting them. It's just a bit weird, you know, because they're flashbacking over things that happened not too long ago. It's not as bad as um dot hack uh G reminisce where you get reminded of things that happened just not even two minutes ago. You got a password. Please use it. I mean, area password, obviously. Like, I don't get what they're thinking. Of course, we're not going to be seeing this area again for a long, long time, so enjoy your glimpse of it now. Because <laughs> it will not reemerge for a while. Okay. I don't know. Even when you're dying, you're still more useful than Klain is sometimes. Ugh. Well, that's because you can't make a lot of alchemy items in this game, because they cap you at 9. Such a weird arbitrary limit, you know? This always bugs me. Ah, it's Cat Boo. Fear her, for she'll turn you into candy! And then eat you. Counting on you. They're probably close by now. Yes, I'm sure they are. Yeah, she has to be referring to Klain and, and Lita, obviously. No worries, this will be a piece of cake. Meow. Yep, like I said, cat boo. I hope she knows well, what cat girl, doing. obviously. Probably not. <laughs> but she knows she likes candy. And that's good oh, enough, okay. right? Hmm. How am I supposed to get there? <laughs> just just think about it, huh? I guess she'll just wander until she finds it. Well, whatever works for you. We don't need your cat cat candy powers for a while anyway. Uh yes. Mana is waning again. Hasn't it been for a while? Yes. The Chief of Fire is a little firebird. It's a Torchic, obviously. And yes, I realize this game came out way before that. <laughs> I believe. Hmm. Ah, yes. Damn. The villain. Still not enough mana. You really don't want to create a Malgo man. It will kill you. I'll definitely need <sighs> the Because he thinks it's not Dr. Octopus. Power. Yes, the Ruby Prism. I don't know why they just didn't go for the Philosopher's Stone, but no, they're like, it's like a, a Ruby Prism. That sounds way better. 
Because the Philosopher's Stone's a piece of the Ruby Prism. Because of reasons. Uh, some rocks. Oh, man. Did we lose him? Lose who? You really did it this time, Clay. Yeah, I suppose he did. Shh, keep it down. Nope. Didn't lose him. Well, now I guess we're going to have to rely on a little alchemy. What's if only it had some elements. Way out here? Why is it being so persistent? Shoot. Out of elements. How could this get any worse? Uh, maybe you could show up and completely emanciate you. You won't get away this time. Take this. Yeah. That strike should have finished him off. Well, this round's a team up. Who are you? Less talk, more fighting. <laughs> should you really turn your back to the enemy like that? Unfortunately, we don't have a lot of options for her just yet. Yes, stab, and he doesn't have any elements right now, so I can only beat the damn thing up with my stick. My stick's not a very effective weapon. At least Leo's fast. We need to keep going. Damn it! Run away! Get back here, you piece of crap, and f take your medicine. My medicine, I mean a whooping. Texas style. You okay? Did it get you? Eh, I'm I've had worse. I haven't seen you around here before. Are you a traveler? I guess you could say that. Traveling alone is dangerous for weaklings. <laughs> Total emanciation right there. What? Yeah, I you heard her. Myself if I hadn't run out of elements. Yeah, save her the excuses. A good alchemist would never run out of elements, now would they? Of <laughs> course you could have. What kind of jerk makes such a lame excuse? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> There's a town nearby called Kavak. How about I show you around? I don't need any help. I've been uh. doing just fine on my own. Man. And yet they get together. Doesn't seem like it right now, okay. now does it? Well, be careful. Well, time to drain some rocks. Ah, oh, man. I didn't even thank her. Guess don't worry, we'll get a chance later, I'm sure. You're right, you are. That's supposed to be my job. Stop being a jerk, man. I bet you like her. Claiming some girl, sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S. -S. <laughs> Don't start. Spare me, Popo. On, let's go. <sighs> At least he's not as scary as the real Mr. Popo. And not the blue one, either. Yeah, yeah. Let's... No, no, I don't need the tutorial. Spare me! Square button! Boom! Boom! Getting some rocks. Give me your stone element. Darn it. Get over here. Oh, that's a good one. It's mine. Yeah, yeah, we can. Okay, let's climb this tree. Sweet. Feather charm. Well, it's not great, but you know, might as well. I mean, what else am I gonna do? Ah, uh, darn it. They won't let me synthesize with it. Not till we get into a battle again. So we can do battle synthesis. Well, I mean, I don't wanna do that, huh, game? It's that bird again. Ooh. 
Well, this time it's screwed, because I have ice bombs! I'm gonna freeze it to death. Like it's Bird Boy. Now Batman Robin. Get it. I've got elements this time. Yep, gotta make sure I don't run out of those again. Yeah, yeah, I don't need to be taught the basics of alchemy. Seriously, spare me, game. Ugh. Darn it. Let's launch an ice bomb. Problem is, I just can never carry enough of these damn things. If I can make, you know, 99 of them, I'd be able to, you know, that more spam so them like that. He was like, no, you get nine. And then you can make, like, nine more. Ugh, it's so disappointing, you know? Great work, Clay. Too bad that girl couldn't see you strut your stuff. Eh, she'll see it eventually. Yeah, we don't even know her name yet. I mean, come on. Hey, that must be the town she mentioned. Yeah, that's it. It's that place on top of the mountain. A legendary place of alchemy. I bet there's an adventure to be had there. Oh, yes, there is. Adventure. Eh, I wouldn't trust those stones. Come on, Popo, Especially that last one. Town. Uh, I wish we could change his name. The only Popo I recognize is Black Popo. He uses a... You know, magic carpet that gets 10 million miles to the soul. Well, now, we gonna get an opening song? Oh, man. That's always scary. Because I always gotta wonder if they're gonna hit me with a copyright claim on stuff like this. But yeah, long others to see highly regarded as the ultimate paradise. Avonbury, the legendary city in the sky. City built by an advanced civilization. Civilization that communicate with Mana, the spirits of the land, for help and guidance. Those who received the guidance of Mana possess special powers. They were called Alchemists. And the greatest of them all was named. Iris, the mana of creation. Ah, interesting. Why are they showing that circle enemy? Oh, amalgam. Yeah, the final boss. Oh, we'll be seeing you again. However, oh, the era of Avatar came to a sudden end. Yeah, when the alchemists tried to fuse multiple mana together and create a monstrosity. <laughs> that undermined the value of life will fail. I suppose they will. And now we're several hundred years later where everyone's basically forgotten about alchemy. For adventurers, seeing the vast treasures hidden within. Good luck getting there. It's not exactly easy to get into Avonbury. <laughs> Probably a good thing considering the forbidden knowledge it contains. Yes. I've never seen that before. You know, because it pops up again and again in the uh, Etrian Odyssey series. You know, we'll have a town surrounding a dungeon. So, this is Camelot. Yeah, it is. Now, how do I get those mushrooms? I'm dead curious. <laughs> no, you're not. You're a snot nosed brat. But whatever. I just love how I can come up with these flowers and just start stealing them all, though. Like, my flower, my flower, mine. This barrel is also mine. And how did I manage to get on top of it? I mean, I was on the stairs. I guess. Darn it. Okay. 260 coal. Sadly, I can only do these one barrel at a time. Ugh. So tedious. Come on. Box! I can't need to do anything with the boxes. Okay. Smack you. 
After all, I won't be able to get those, uh, freaking, um, uh, Landos are so basic. Problem is, you can get some rare Landos if you keep doing that, but I can only ever carry a maximum of nine of the darn things. It's such an irritant. And how do I get up top here? I want the shrooms. Please to meet me, huh? Yeah. Well, I'm probably broke. Uh, I do have some money, but you're not selling anything I really want right now. Oh, that's blocked, huh? That's a shame. Okay. Again, I see mushrooms back there, but how do I get them? Because I can't walk on that. I see that chest back there. It's like teasing me. I can't jump high enough. Okay. Okay, let's just itemize this stuff. Boom. Your mind. What? These Landos and stuff will fall, so it's not like they're stuck up there. Yeah, I know, I just try to, you know, turn that kid into elements. It doesn't work, so don't worry. I can't just go around killing people by striking them with my magic staff. Come on, I need more wood element. At least there aren't as many elements in this game as, um, the second game. I'll be, the second game makes it a lot easier to, you know, stockpile the damn things. At least there's that. Because <sighs> there's areas where you can go in and get, like, you know, spears of elements, you know, for, like, 50. Ugh. Of course, the second game has, you know, basically an infinite money setup you can do, too. Okay, let's head into this, this place, you know. Hi there. Okay. You're new around here, aren't you? What gave it away? My traveler's cloak? I'm from Gizestein. Hmm. I have no idea how far away that is from here. Far. Are you a traveler? Well, I'd imagine I would be if I'm all the way out here in I the middle of nowhere. So. Actually, I'm an alchemist. An alchemist? That's yeah, don't get too many of those types. In fact, I don't think I've ever met one before. Damn, that's rare. And they used to be so yeah. common too. Yeah, could be my fault though. I hear there used to be a lot in these parts. Yeah, that was over a hundred years ago. So what brings you to our humble little town? I'm looking for um, alchemy, alchemy recipes. Guidance. I'd also yep. like to find some mana. I'm still kind of new at this alchemy thing. Yep. Actually, Still young and new. Towns connected with alchemy. Well, we I hit the jackpot for that. But I can tell you're serious about this. Is it my eyes? They look kind of dead to me, but I'll believe you, Norman. I'm sure you're a good bartender slash um, cook. In the area, but I'm not sure whether or not they have much to do with alchemy. <laughs> if you mean Avonbury, it has well, everything to do with alchemy. Food, though. Feel free to stay as long as you'd like. I'd love to, but I don't have much money. Yeah, I tend to go light on the cash. <laughs> I see. How'd you like to earn a little extra? Yep, by killing a Galgazette. The price was right. What kind of jobs do you have for me? Oh, <laughs> I just need these lunch boxes dropped off at the magic shop and the grocery store. They shouldn't be eh, too that ain't hard. To find as you explore the town. The magic shop is just up the hill next door. The grocery store is right across the street from here. Yeah, I know it's there. They don't okay, sell very good groceries. Easy. Yes, mission accepted. I know. If you have any luggage, you don't have to tell me it's a mission. It. What luggage? Ugh. Yes. My save journal. Such great luggage, you know? Ah. Uh, 
nothing much. But let's get healed up, I guess, just because we can. Nah, whatever. Let's go deliver these lunches. No one has any good jobs for us right now, anyway. I probably shouldn't break those um, elements down again. I'm kind of getting close to topped up. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, I'm just supposed to drop off this lunchbox from the bartender. Yep, we delivered all right. Uh, I guess. Yeah, it's all kinds of things. Stop by whenever you want. And by lots of things, she means very few things right now. It does expand as the story goes on, like all games do, though. Uh, just some common Landos. I don't want those. I've already got a couple. I don't need any more right now. I'll take some foul water, though. Okay. Might as well grab that dark mana. Haha. Got myself some green peppers, and that's why I didn't buy the grass. I can get my own. I don't need any help. Okay, got ourselves a skinny log. Okay, let's go up top. They sometimes hide logs and stuff up here. I don't know why. It's a bit weird, you know? But to each their own, I guess. Oh, the incompetent captain ain't here right now. Good. Can't do what? Play the pipe organ? Yeah, I probably wouldn't trust you either. Barrel. Okay, what's in the barrel? barrel? Nothing, apparently, in that one. Fine. Okay, get some more grass, I guess. Come on. Anything hiding up here this time? Nope, just that once, I guess. That's fine. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's a well. I can grab some well water from there. And get some potatoes. After all, I'm going to need those later, I'm sure. To make some recipes. Boom. Uh, a nice pot, eh? Hmm. You really should be checking out the pot, man. We just got the town. You gotta meet some people before you start doing the pot. Um, is this the magic shop? I'm supposed to deliver this lunchbox from the bar. Yep, that's her uncle. Well, we can get close to the viola later. She's pretty standoffish, you know, for a while. Uh, no, I'm not. However, I didn't make all these items. Really? Assume you're an alchemist? Yep, I sure am. Is it really, though? Considering Clean sucks at right now. Oh, she does, does she? She'll be on your way, right? You can go now. Yeah, she's very dismissive. Yeah, I know where the grocery store is. I was there first. I was there before I even started the side quest. Jeez. Ugh. Dumb game. Tell me what to do. Most inefficient way possible. Okay. Darn it. Can't make it. Someday. Someday I'll make it. Okay. Um, we actually, girl, the magic told me you might have some alchemy supplies here. Alchemy, what's that? It's, uh... Al you never heard of it? Well, you're not giving a very good definition of it, now are you? I just want talking about that box. I've had a box in the back room for a really long time now. A box? There's a flower vase or something inside the box, that's probably what she meant. Flower vase? So I had to take them both. I have no idea what they're for. Feel free to take a look. It's a heal jar. 
which she just casually has sitting back here, you know, because reasons. I don't know, but now we can make it. Yeah, it's a mod I'm created with alchemy. It has healing properties. Popo can help us make these, albeit he's not the best pick for it, because I think it requires a focus on water. Which is, um... Popo's, you know, secondary affinity, really. Yep, enough items. I don't need to worry about that right now. No, I don't. I know the basics, trust me, game. Oh, gosh darn it. Abort! Abort! Let me abort! No! Abort! 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 I can't abort! Damn it! Damn it! Let me out of here! Faster! Faster! Damn you! I don't need this lesson! I know that you lose different amounts. I can get a water mana later. But... Right now, we only have wood. Ugh. And to keep him happy, you gotta feed him items. I'm not really interested in feeding Popo anything right now. Yeah, yeah, can I just get back to my stuff? Thank you. Ugh. Well. Guess we're gonna have to tell her it's an alchemy item, alright. Wasn't really a flower vase? Box of the f hood of the mountain just north of town. There's supposed to be a lot of treasure hidden in the sea at the top of that mountain. Probably more alchemy items, too. I thought it was a vase. I suppose it was. It's a little thick. You know, you like, consider a commission for the lunchbox. Yeah, that's what the mountain sea It's all just legends, really. Oh, wait. I think Nora and the bartenders know legend pretty well. You should ask him about it. Thanks. I love how there's a basement here, too. Well, no. Yeah, I can't get around that, though. Eventually, we'll go in the sewers, but just not right now. Yeah, because every game, you know, has to, is better when you go into the sewers, right? That's one of the most important aspects you have in a game, you know, having to go into the sewers. Ugh. Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, you know, we'll go talk to Norman at the bar and learn the legends of the area. Until then, see ya.